Our suffering due to the water shortage has turned into a state of fear that won't go away. My husband goes onto the roof every day to see if the water tanks have been filled. On one unforgettably terrifying night, I decided to go on the roof with him to help. We suddenly heard a loud explosion followed by shouting somewhere close on our street. Very quietly and carefully, we shuffled over to the edge of the roof to peer down. We saw a group of Islamic State fighters. They were shooting in the air. I feared for my husband because they were banging on doors searching for men in order to question them. It turned out that the explosion was caused by a bomb planted on one of the IS vehicles. Within a few seconds, the terrifying sound of the fighter jets filled the sky and they started bombing the Islamic State fighters. Their vehicles were full of ammunition and we kept hearing explosions for over three hours. I was trembling with fear and dreading the sound of the doorbell. But thankfully, the air bombing caused a great deal of confusion among the IS fighters and they didn't knock on our door.